This is the Roulette Master, and if you're new to my channel, please subscribe by hitting the red subscribe button in the lower right hand corner. Also, ring that bell for notifications because I have new content releasing every single day of the week at 9 a.m. Today's video was messaged to me by one of my subscribers, Jim P, and he plays 212s. And as always, let me know if you like his system, if you don't like it, or if you would modify it. And if so, um, let me know down in the comments how you would modify it. And uh, let's go ahead and get started and um, see if you like his system or not. So he starts with $10 on two of the 12s that didn't hit the last. So that, that would mean we hit a one there. So now we don't bet on the first 12 because of that. And we put 10 on the second and third. Okay, and we lost. And then when you lose, you actually go from 10 to 30. And then we won that one. So then when you win, you go back to 10, but you uh, go on the two 12s that haven't hit. So now we would bet on the first 12 and third 12 because the 20 is in the second 12, which hit last. Okay, and we won on that one. So now we bet on the first and second 12 because the third 12 just hit. Okay, we won that one. So now we would bet on the first 12 and the third 12 because the 15's in the second. Okay, we lost that one. So we would rebet and then add or change those to 30 from 10 to 30. Okay, we won that one. So then we bet on the 12s except for the first one, which has the nine in it. We lost that one. So then we would rebet and then change those to 30. So right now we're up $50 and we would bet on the first and the third because the 13 is in the second 12. And we lost that one. So we would change those tens to thirties. And then we won that one. So now we're up $60 and we'd bet on the 12s that, except for the first one, which has the 10 in it. And then we lost that one. So we would change those from 10 to 30. and we won that one so now we're up seventy dollars and we would bet on the first and second because the 25 is in the third 12 and we lost so then we would change those from 10 to 30 We lost again, so then we would change those from 30 to 90. Then we won, so we start back over again. Now we're up $80, and we bet on the second and third 12.
Then we lost that one. So we change them from 10 to 30. I accidentally put an extra 10 on that third 12 there. So that lost me an extra $10. But we did lose that one. So you can see that one was supposed to be a $60 bet. So now we change those to 90. And we won that one. So we're up 80. We should be up 90. I made a mistake back there. And then we'll start with first 12 and third 12 again. And we lost that one. So we'll go from 10 to 30. Okay, and we won that one, so we'll start back at 10, and up $90 now, and we'll bet on the first and second, because 27 is in the third 12. Okay, we got a win there, so now we'll bet on the second and third 12, and the 12 with the 7 will be left vacant. Lost that one, so we'll go from 10 to 30. We won that one, so now we're up $110, and we're betting on the first and third, and leaving the second 12 with the 19 in it vacant. Okay, we won that one. So now we'll bet first and second and leave the third open where the 31 is. And we lost. So then we'll change those from 10 to 30. We lost again. So now those will change to 90. And we won, so we start back over. Now we're up $130, and we're betting on the first and the third. And we won that one. So now we're up 140, and we're betting on first and second 12. We lost that one, so we'll change from 10 to 30. Okay, we won that one, so now we're up 150. And we'll bet on the first and third 12 and leave the second 12 open that has the 15 in it. Okay, we lost. So then we go from 10 to 30. Okay, we lost again. So now we'll go to 90. We lost again. So now we'll go from 90 to 270. And how far you go with this um, determines how much you use for a starting fund. And so now we're at 270.
Okay. And we got it. And according to Jim P, he would also go to 810 after 270 um, on this system. But if you did go to 810, you would need a, uh, let's see, that would be about a 20, 20, $2,400 startup, and if you stopped at 270 it would be an $810 um, startup fund that you would need. So it uh, just depends if you want to go one more time, but um, it seemed like we got up there, but with this startup fund that he gave us, uh, that we should start with 2400 then we were still okay. We would have had another chance to bet even if we had lost that one. Now we're up 160 and we're betting on first and second 12 and I'm sure that you could use this system with smaller increments as well if you didn't want to start with ten dollars as the starting bet okay we lost that one so then we'll go to 30 maybe one so now we'll bet on second and third 12, leave the first 12 with the five in it open. And we won. Now we're up 180. Bet on the first and second 12. And leave the one with the 25 open. Okay, we got another win. Now we're up 190. We're betting on first and third and leaving the second 12 open that has the 20 in it. And we lost, so we're going to change those from 10 to 30. We lost again, so now we would change from 30 to 90. And we lost again. Okay, so then we go to 270. And we'll have one more chance to win even after, if we lose this one, we'll have one more chance. Let's see if we can get one on this spin. And we got it. Okay, so now we're up $200 and we're betting first and second and leaving the third open. Okay, we got it. So now we're betting second and third and leaving the first open. Okay, we lost, so then we'll change those from 10 to 30. We won, so we start back over again. We're up 220. We'll bet first and second and leave the 12 with the 30 open. One there, now we're up 230. Let's bet on first and third. So we leave the one open with the 23. Alright, now we're getting a few wins in a row. We're up 240. We bet on the first and second and leave the third 12 open. We got it. Now we're getting a little bit of a winning streak. We're up 250 and we'll bet first and third. Alright, and we lost, so we'll go to 30. And we got it so now we're up $260 and um, hope you like this system that Jim P sent in and um, as always let me know if you like it if you don't like it or if you would modify it and if so let me know how down in the comments and um, also if you have a system that you play please send it in to me I would love to showcase it on the channel and um, 
As always, try this out on your uh, apps and see if you like it before you take it to the casino because um, any roulette system can fail. And um, if you go through the progression, and uh, you will lose your startup fund. But um, at the same time, this is a good way to make money, I think. Um, I think it's, it's a good one, but you have to know what you're risking. So um, I'm looking forward to any modifications that some of you might have that's a little bit less risky on this one. And um, look forward to hearing those. Uh, thanks again, Jim P, for sending this one in. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please hit the red subscribe button in the lower right-hand corner. Also ring that bell for notifications because I have new content releasing every single day of the week at 9 a.m. This is the Roulette Master, and have a great day.